What's up, YouTube? Got a mega haul for you guys today. So let's just get right into it. So I uh, went to meet my Matco dealer today. Got uh, the new um, magaz or um, flyers from my area. Uh, I found out that some of the flyers are not the same in all regions. So that's pretty interesting. But these are the two flyers that I got. Leave down, leave a comment in the comment section if you guys want me to peruse through these two flyers to show you guys what's um, on sale in my area. So the first thing I got um, was this magnetic tool mat. Um, powerful magnet holds tools, fasteners, you know, tracks any ferrous metal surface, uh, otherwise a magnetic surface. And uh, you can see there the tools being displayed um, adhered to the mat. This is 11 by 9.5 or 24.9 by 49.5 for metric folks. Uh, and there's your part number, uh, Mary Mary 11X19. Um, so uh, this mag that magnetic tool mat is pretty nice. Uh, I think this was around $40 um, with my dealer. Um, I'm trying to roll it out there. Let's put it on the car here. Um, flip it over this way. Um, you can see there it's got the Matco um, tag on there. Um, let's see if this is made in the USA. Because you never know with Matco stuff. Oh, let's see. Where's the... Uh, oh, let's see here. Made in China. So there you go. Made in China. So for all you guys that wanted to know that. There's a little bit about it. Um, so let's go ahead and test that out. It seems to stick to the uh, car very well, which is pretty cool. Um, let's go ahead and put some wrenches on there. Um, a couple wrenches. Um, let's throw, let's see if I've got some big sockets here. Put a couple snap-on sockets on there and just kind of see. Oh, God, please don't roll off and hit my car. Uh, let's just see how that, uh, that does. And that's pretty neat. So there you go, guys. Holds it fantastically, if that's a word. Um, but, yeah, so that's one of the things we picked up. So that'll come in handy. Um, another thing I got for free was this uh, Mac Tools hubcap and wheel lock kit. It's older, it was used, it was in the trade-in bin. I thought it was pretty neat to have. I thought I could use it. So I picked that guy up for free. Um, it's old, so like I said, it's just, it's whatever. But um, it was uh, on the truck, it is Mac Tools. Lifetime guarantee, couldn't pass it up. Uh, the second thing, I, or the third thing I got was this MicroStream USB light, 250 lumens. Uh, this is the first, um, stream light that I've ever owned um, you see there really nice really bright um, I've never owned a stream light before I don't know if it has multiple settings I don't think it does yeah it does it's got a really bright and a dimmer switch on there so that's pretty cool a couple modes um, it does have the Matco uh, logo on it um, really nice um, let's, it does come with a lanyard as well so I guess Maybe that could be um, convenient for some people. Um, let's see here. USB rechargeable, 1.1 uh, Candelia on high, two modes, high and low. Sl uh, sliding sleeve uh, protects USB. So, yeah, so I remember, there you go. And you can recharge it. Hopefully you guys can see that. There you go. So you can, your USB port, and it's got an O-ring there. So that kind of protects against moisture ingression. So that's pretty cool, and I like the color on this as well. It's like a tactical color. Um, I thought that was pretty neat as well. So, yeah, I picked that up. Um, wasn't too bad as, as far as price goes. That's the really bright mode. Um, but, yeah, that's pretty cool. The third thing I got, um, bring this over here, and I'll save the best for last, um, was this 52-piece um, general set. Um, so this is a quarter-inch drive. Uh, let's see here. This is Silver Eagle, um, 62 ratchet, but I heard that these ratchets are no longer offered. So if you have an issue with this ratchet, you can trade it in, get the most modern version of the quarter inch drive, um, 
Matt Cole Ratchet with no, or sorry, uh, Silver Eagle Ratchet without any issues. Uh, but this is the 62 that comes with it. These bits are not lifetime guarantee, but if you ever break one, they my guy says he would cut me a deal and get me the, the lifetime guarantee bits, but everything else in the kit is lifetime guarantee. And this is a quarter inch drive set. So once again, one of those general service sets. Now, everybody's been talking about the, uh, the Snap-on um, quarter inch drive set. And I've seen a lot of good posts on Instagram and everywhere else um, about how they calculate the value of the set. And I guess, you know, looking at the calculations on that set, um, the asking price, especially hearing that some guys here are getting it for, you know, a thousand or even less than that. Um, apparently, based upon based upon some of the calculations I've seen, it appears to be a fairly good price for it. Um, obviously, if you're paying the twelve hundred dollars or the twenty four hundred, um, you're paying way more than what um is standard so let's see here see if i can get this open for you guys and i'm doing this with one hand this is one of those nights where a uh, tripod would have come in handy so apologize but uh so here's a socket sets productivity design gives you all of that countersunk guys etc large stamping uh, accessible switch, comfort design, productivity, leverage, you know, all the traditional stuff that they kind of sell you on. Um, and then you see your six point standard sockets go from uh, metric is 3 16 up to 9 16 and met or SAE is 3 16 up to 9 16 and metric is four, four and a half, five, five and a half, uh, all the way up to 15 millimeter. Um, so, and the same thing is true for the deeps as well. Um, all the way up to 15 and a 30 piece screwdriver bit set, etc. So, really, really cool. And I'm not saying it's as good as the snap on deal, of course, it's not right. Uh, but this is a nice set and it comes in a nice blow molded Silver Eagle case, which we all love, um, meaning that we all love a good case. Uh, and I figured that this set would be something that would travel with me in my truck or even perhaps my car. Um, so there, there it is guys. So pretty nice set. You guys see there four all the way up to, uh, 13 there. And, um, there we go. Three sixteenths all the way up to nine sixteenths. Um, so there you go. It's pretty cool. And it comes with two extensions a probably a two inch and a six inch maybe. And then you have your little small quarter inch bit ratchet. Um, and then you have your regular quarter inch drive ratchet there as well uh, this is the first silver eagle set that i i've ever owned um i do have some quarter inch stuff but primarily it's snap on sk um, and then i have this little small titan um quarter inch drive bit or uh, quarter inch drive ratchet but that's pretty much it so this is pretty nice set um did i need it probably not uh, but given the fact that this is going to be something that um, I'm going to keep in the car with me, yeah, I can justify having that with me. Um, so really, really, really happy to have this. Like I said, it's no way a comparison to the uh, Snap-on deal. They give you way lot, way more tools, and uh, I'm not going to comment on quality because I've never used Silver Eagle, so I can't comment on that. But they look really nice, so I think they're going to be more than suitable for my level of use so there's your part number on that kit and uh really really nice set so really happy to have that everybody's on that quarter inch drive kick so i figured hell why not join in with everyone else you know and uh and the last thing i got and i forgot to put that back in there so let's move that over there and the last thing that i got guys you guys ready for it you're not ready for it. Maybe I'll make, make you wait a little longer. Okay, <laughs> let's do it. Got the M12 fuel, guys. I got the uh, right angle tool, um, 220 foot pounds of nut bust and torque, access to small spaces, four drive. You guys seen it. Everybody's got these things already. There's your part number 2564-20. Um, I had to get one. Um, he worked out a good deal for me. I think this was the last one on the truck. And uh, my Matco dealer is also a good friend of mine. And uh, I think he was wanting to, you know, go ahead and move it. 
Um, and so I just happened to be there. I tossed the idea around a little bit. And uh, once I start looking at everything that I bought, I said, let's go ahead and amp it up a little bit more. So I picked this guy up. And uh, I got a lot of Milwaukee stuff. So I've got the M18 courtesy of uh, Justin Dow. So it hooked it up for me. Um, so that was really cool. I was able to win that from him. Um, I got an M12 that I bought on my own. I got a M18 um, regular drill. And so I got all of the um, batteries and all that good stuff. So good to go in that regard. Um, but yeah, here you go, guys. So I got one. Um, brushless design. You guys have seen it. Everybody's talked about it. I'm not going to try to talk anything new about it, but I own one as well now. So really, really happy to have that. Can't wait to use it. Let's go ahead and throw a battery in there. Let's see what we got. Oh, let's see if I can pop one of these suckers out. This is the four amp battery. And I'm trying to do this with all one hand. So there we go. Did I get it? I think I got it. Let's do, oh, it didn't come on. There we go. So let's go, it's on one now. Let's put it on three. Yeah, <laughs> that's nice. So um, <laughs> yeah, I like that a lot. That's really, really nice. So I didn't realize it has that little locking feature there. Put it in the middle there, it doesn't engage. And that's your direction. Up. So yeah, that's really, really cool. Um, so happy to have that. Um, like I said, it was something that it was an impulse buy, but uh, the deal was right. Um, let's just say I didn't pay very much for it. He was trying to move it and um, I was just happened to be there on the truck at the right moment. So uh, thank you, Terry, for hooking it up. Terry Gilbert, mid um, He's in my area. He's my Matco dealer. So if you're in the Fort Wayne, Columbia City, Warsaw area, and you're watching my videos, uh, look up Terry Gilbert, guys. Get him over there and get you some good deals off the Matco truck. Um, it's got all the other stuff in there. You guys know it. I'm not going to go through all the settings because everybody and their mother has already reviewed this thing. So I'm not going to jump on the bandwagon. But yeah, this is this is my mega tool, guys. My mega. Oh, sorry. I got one more thing. Get ready to run away. Last thing I got, wire stripper. So got had to pick this up. I seen it on the truck. He thought he had gave me one, um, and I thought he had as, as well, but that was not the case. And so he gave me an awesome deal. Basically, I almost got this thing for free, uh, but he hooked me up, got me one of these. I never had this style before, so really happy to have that. Um, I don't have a part number on it because there isn't a part number listed on here, but it's like a WCX or a WX or something like that. Um, but yeah, really, really cool. So very happy to have it. So yeah, guys, that's my Matco tool haul. I think I've covered everything. Um, really, really good day. Um, uh, hope you guys liked it. Um, some, you know, some awesome tools. We're going to be doing some more videos. We've got a couple projects coming up, um, that I'm going to be working on here, pulling some parts. I'm going to take you guys with me. As I go out there and pull some parts, we're going to put this uh, this right angle to, to use. We're going to also put that M18 to use. Got a couple suspension parts I got to pull for the uh, the Project BMW. And so um, I'm going to go ahead and pull those parts. I'm going to take these tools out there, kind of hit it hard. Maybe just do a whole Milwaukee thing where I take this guy, take the M18 and the M12 out there and kind of let, let it have it. So let them eat. So, uh, like I said, really happy to have the right angle now. I've joined the bandwagon, I guess, if you will, as far as having one of those in my arsenal. Um, so we're going to use it. We're going to put it to use. That's what these tools are for. Um, so that's what it is. All right, guys. Thank you for checking in. Don't forget, leave me a comment. Make sure you smash that like button. If you don't like the video, hit the dislike, um, you know, and then leave a comment. Um, I try to get to all the comments. As you guys know, that's one of the things I pride myself on. So leave a comment. I try to get to it. I try to reply to you. Um, just let me know what you think about the tool haul. Uh, please hit that like button. As creators, it only matters when you guys are smashing that like button. Um, so leave me a comment. Do what you do. Catch me, guys, on the next one. Mint was to review. Out.